Hello guys, welcome back to another interesting episode of Living Colors. Guys, keeping an axolotl as a pet is a most unique and enjoyable adventure. This creature are a complete blast. They are active, engaged with their owners and unbelievably cute. In our today's video, we will be discussing about this unique pet. If you have not yet subscribed our channel, please do subscribe and enable the bell icon so that you don't miss any of our interesting video. Guys, axolotls are only found in Mexico. They are often referred to a Mexican walking fish. They are unique aquatic salamander. Unlike other salamander species, they never go through a physical change to become a land dwellers. As a result of this, axolotls spend their entire life in water. Even with their fully formed legs, this aquatic creature doesn't need any access to land. Some people view them as reptile while others view them as fish. The actual truth is axolotls are amphibians. On average, the lifespan of axolotl in captivity is around 10 years. There is a chance that it may live longer. In fact, some owners have reported lifespan of up to 20 years. Axolot's care isn't too difficult as long as you understand their basic need. All you need is to provide the essentials including creating good habitat and a quality diet. In an average, axolotls can grow up to 10 inch in length. In wild, they can grow much larger than this. One of the most important part of axolotl care is water conditions. Axolotls have a delicate skin which makes them far more sensitive to extreme change in water condition than other creatures. The water parameters to be followed in order to keep your axolotl happy and healthy are Water temperature between 60 to 64 Fahrenheit is ideal. These creatures like to live in a cold water. pH level between 6.5 to 7.5. Water hardness should be between 7 to 8 dKh. These creatures are known to produce lot of waste. You would have to be more proactive about changing the water to ensure your axolotl doesn't get sick because of ammonium and nitrate level in the water. You should also be careful about the type of filter to be used since axolotls prefer still water. In addition to getting the water condition right, you should also ensure that they have a well decorated tank that works with the axolotl's need. In wild, this creature typically spend a lot of time at the bottom of the water. So you will need to pay close attention to the substract to be used. These creatures are known to swallow the small pieces of gravel, which can cause an intestinal block. If you do use gravels, make sure the pieces are bigger than the axolotl's head. There should be plenty of hiding place like rocks and caves. You can utilize pieces of driftwoods and plastic decoration to create some hiding place. Live plants are also appreciated. Axolotls do good with Anubias and Java fern. Despite their hardness, axolotls are not immune to stress-related disease. Poor water condition have been known to cause problems like bacterial infection and fungal infections. Axolotls get access to wide variety of diet in wild. They will eat snails, fish and even other amphibians. In captivity, they do the best on protein-rich food like earthworm, bloodworms and brain shrimp. You can also feed live feeding fish to your axolotl, but make sure they do not carry any parasite in them because this can cause a serious health issue to your axolotl. Axolotl should be fed only 2 or 3 times a week. 
this might seem a little unusual because we usually feed our fish on a daily basis but this is totally normal for this creature it is not recommended to keep any other tank mates with your axolotl this includes other axolotls also though some owners have seen success in keeping bonding pair together but you have to be very careful and keep a watch eye on them these animals are known to fight among one another cannibalistic behavior is pretty common you might see two axolotl fighting and losing their limbs the good news is axolotl have an ability to regenerate their limb after injury however you should just avoid this issue altogether and keep them apart axolotls are a solitary creature and do just fine when they are alone guys most of you might have a question can axolotls be kept outside the water and can it be handled no guys it is not recommended to remove the axolotls from the water and to be handled axolotls have a very delicate skin most of their body is made up of cartilage rather than bones as a result of this they are exposed to injuries thus it is recommended to use net to catch the axolotl and even if it is placed outside the water it should be placed only for couple of seconds with this we are ending our today's video do let us know if you would like more videos on axolotls so see you soon with another interesting video